Now, the worldwide drive to find new sources of oil is leading to new jobs and investment at several cutting-edge businesses around the region. The Southwest has a number of companies that have invented new technology which is being exported to oil companies across the globe. Our business correspondent Neil Gallagher reports. It looks like a scaffold pole with teeth on the end. Closer inspection suggests someone's bent it. It's actually a hugely valuable invention with world-beating potential. This is a drill assembly for operation deep below the ground, which can gradually turn corners as it goes. It's been developed by a small knowledge-led Exeter business. The engineer who founded Antec had worked abroad in Houston, but chose Exeter as a home base from which to develop his invention. Now his business, with its 30 staff, has been bought into by the world's biggest oil firm, Saudi Aramco. And he says the region has more of this sort of success than people realise. There is good, strong engineering happening in all sorts of different places and there are talented teams working in all sorts of companies like ours that are actually doing, uh, are doing very well. A perfect example of this is just outside Truro. This firm makes protective cages used worldwide to transfer oil workers between ships and rigs. It's just opened a half million pound new HQ here. Being so far west is fine by them. Uh, it's definitely getting easier, I think, and certainly communications and obviously things like the internet and developments there have made it a lot more possible. And when you're exporting 80% of your products as we are, actually it doesn't matter so much what specific location you're in as long as you can find ways to communicate with your clients. Another Southwest company that's recently invested hundreds of thousands of pounds, partly because of its work in oil and gas exploration, is the Barnstable subsea engineering specialist J&S. The high price of oil is something we all curse about, but the oil industry as a result is investing heavily and there are clearly some benefits. Neil Gallagher, BBC Spotlight.